Hello everybody, Basso Contour here. And today we're taking a look at this Garmin Chirp. And this is a really neat device for use in geocaching. What's interesting about this device is how incredibly small it is. And I wanted to explain to you some clever ways to use this device. Now you can see here the Chirp with the little button battery that goes inside. And it's really not that difficult to get the case off. You twist the case off counterclockwise just a very short distance and then you can take the back off. When you go ahead to put the case back on, notice that there's a little dot that you align to make sure that the case is completely shut. The product also comes with a small circular adhesive and you can go ahead and put this on the back to fasten it to something. And here's another look at the adhesive. Now there's one main feature about using this product that I've discovered that most geocachers don't realize. You actually do not need to buy a special GPS unit. You can use a free application called the Ant Plus Sampler. And I have tried this and it works very well. After you've downloaded and installed the app, this is what the screen will look like. And you can see there's various utilities and of course you want to select the one called Geocache Utility. At that point it will begin searching for your chirp. And in this example here it's found mine and mine is called Basso. Once you click on the chirp then you can download the details from the chirp and of course it will have the location or hints or anything that you've programmed on the chirp. Keep in mind that when you program the chirp, you don't just give it the latitude and longitude, you can actually give it other information such as a hint, and that's what I've done with my chirp. In a similar fashion, you could program the chirp and it literally just takes a few seconds. You specify which items you wish to program and you put the information in and basically say go. It's that simple and I was able to program my device in less than one minute. So all in all, I thought the Garmin Chirp device worked extremely well. I thought the range was just fine. And with this new way of detecting and programming the device, I predict this device is going to be a lot more popular. On the Dipsy Trail in Northern California, this is Basso Contour. Thanks for watching, everybody.